Hi guys, welcome back to Red Dog Gaming where we are continuing our let's play on Rome Total War Remastered as the great nation of Parthia. Now last time we declared war on Nub Numidia, I was going to say Nubia then, Numidia, um, and we attacked into Greece, mainly fighting the Bruti, to be honest, they've, they've done quite well, got, got control of nearly all of Greece, but look at us now, three big strong armies ready to fight them we've also got this army up here who is ready to fight this macedonian army um, which we don't actually know how strong it is but they do have royal pikemen they're only six armor though not hugely powerful the militia hoplites are terrible uh, mercenary hoplites reasonable uh, but yeah we should be able to beat them quite quite handily i believe um, Campus Getai could do with a blacksmith here, a few blacksmiths, uh, but we're getting a bazaar instead. Actually, let's cancel that out for the blacksmith. Uh, now, are we at the end of the turn? I believe we are. Obviously, Rhodes, we were just um, we were just sieging it down. Um, we can't really get the problem is we can't really get into the city because they're, they're blocking all the walls so hmm, we're just going to siege that one down I believe now everywhere else how are we doing getting this army into Namidia getting a peasant to take Siwa you need to run away please that would be ideal if not that would be quite annoying <laughs> Uh, yeah, we've got governors in there. Excellent. Very nice. So we're doing quite well. We're doing quite well, I think. Um, up here against Scythia, it's still uh, going quite Fire. tough. But we're sending this army up here to deal with the Scythians. Now let's end the turn. Without further ado, let's see whether the Romans want to come and play. Now we destroyed three of their large armies before like completely ruined three full stacks um, so let's see what they want to do oh there we are there's Macedon We're on the siege. Um, yeah so we destroyed three of their large armies which was pretty good pretty fun um, and that's basically left the whole of the rest of Greece pretty open now they just did they just recruit some troops in there Looks like they did. So it's a bit laggy. So I don't know why. Must be something going on. I think we need to go into a battle and come back out again. But I think the first battle we'll do, Thessalonica doing well, is definitely gonna be. Oh, we need to check ships as well. I, great lord. And armies. We've got these elephants. Uh, we've also got all these guys. Plus... Uh, you, I'm guessing? Send you here. We're going to come down to Pergamum and Sardis and pick up the rest of the troops. Send them across, and then we've got another new army. So we're pretty, uh, we're pretty hefty right now in terms of armies coming of age. Vimusa of Asak. Oh, that's Vimusa. So who is this in here? He's thirty-one, but he's definitely better as a commander than he is a gen uh, a governor. Settlement besieged. Yep, we know that. Macedon. What is declared? Scipii and Namidia. Okay, so Scipio have declared war in the video as well. Like it looks like Carthage is pretty much dead. Um, let's get these buildings done. Get some more law up there. Um, Sardis. Ooh, what do we want with Sardis? Um, something that takes a couple of turns. Probably that because we're about to upgrade. Halicarnassus. Okay, blacksmith. Pergamum. Um, yeah, I think hmm, more law. 
Campus Scythiae. Uh, let's go for Armourer. Themyscira, just in case. I don't think we'll get to the point where that armour will get used, but maybe it will do. Sparta. Um, Sparta? What do we want in Sparta? To get like, elite cavalry stables. Um, I think we'll go for that while we're across here, definitely. Siwa. Get you. And then Thebes. Yeah, you're building, so no problems there. Um, right, we'll get you out of there. See what happens if we put you to low. Excellent. Now, we kind of need to destroy these guys. It'll be really, really easy and quick. So, that'll be good. We'll move you guys to here. This is a problem, see? I don't know where the actual settlement is. Same up here. I'm guessing it's over here, you know. Yes, there it is. Ficus Venadi. There we are. Domus Dulcis Domus. Okay, they're all... That's one thing. I wish, like, in this... I know, okay. Oh, right, okay. Seleucia, Susa, Hashra, whatever. These ones are kind of uh, cultural names. But, like, these ones up here are all... Uh, like Vicus Venadi, that's a Roman name. Domus Dulcus Domus, definitely a Roman name. Um, so yeah, it would be nice to have non-Roman name, if you know what I mean, um, involved there. Right, let us... So we've got found our two city and settlement to kill. Let us start our first battle. And... We, we don't necessarily... We don't need to win this. Thracian mercenaries. They have some very experienced levy pikemen, but that's not going to make a difference to them getting shot because it's no armor and no shield. It's just defensive skill bonus. Um, but yeah. They have ballistas as well, which we kind of need to be careful of. I don't want to get caught out by that, but we should be good. Um, if we, obviously, if we don't manage to destroy these guys... Um, with all our arrows, we can just uh, retreat, withdraw, come back next turn. But Macedon isn't the most heavily armoured faction, so I don't think we will need to come back next turn, to be honest. <laughs> I think we'll be okay. Well, we'll see. But yeah, I'm surprised we uh, shredded those Roman armies so well. But yeah, we absolutely shredded them. Um, I've been playing a lot of our Isengard campaign in Third Age Total War recently, so uh, coming back to this, it's a nice little change of pace, really. Um, this is the first battle, so it'll take a while for it to load, but it's a nice little, uh, cheeky little change of pace. Um, very, very, very different fighting style <laughs> to Isengard, which, to be honest, a lot of Third Age is, um, a lot of the battles in Third Age are on kind of like slogs. It's just a grind, grinding through the enemy troops, if you know what I mean. Um, compared to, yeah, you know, this is firing a lot of arrows. So <laughs> I guess you could say it's a slog as well. But um, it's a very, very powerful and OP slog, but it's still a slog. Um, but yeah, those, those uh, the Third Age battles are just kind of like a big grind. You know, lots of melee troops fighting each other. Um, so it's a nice little difference, I guess you would say. We'll uh, stick these boys here. Archers can go... Archerers, as they say. Archerers can go on the wall. You boys can go here. Um, and... I'm hoping that's all of them. So let's go, boys. It's so nice to have proper controls as well again. Don't want to waste my ammo firing at the ballista, but it looks like we're probably going to catch up to the ballista first. Why do they always go, like, into a little corner? Uh, don't put you on skirmish mode. Well, we are losing frames. Get 
in there. Don't want to fire at will anymore. Get in there, boys. As you can see, we are definitely losing frames. I don't know whether that's just the computer just struggling. It shouldn't be struggling. But it might be. Get down there. We do have the enemy general, but we'll bring our general to, to worry about that, I'm guessing. Um, okay, that's a better unit than mercenary hoplites. So phallic pikemen. Not I, not the best pikemen, but this they're okay. Taking a few of these boys down. Um, don't want to get stuck in between the wall, etc. But what are they? They're Thracian mercenaries. They're quite a good one to try and take down. Oh, look at them falling. They've just got so little armor, all these troops, that it's... I think the most they have is six. It's nice to get uh, a bit more of experience on these boys, if we can. Come on, lads! Levy. There's the Royal Pikeman. Oh my god, look at it. It's just a hail. A hail of arrows. Just constant. Shoot him if you can, the Royal Pikeman. Yeah, I'm not sure we'll be able to kill them all. I mean, we'll kill uh, a lot. But maybe not all. A bit on the double speed as well. Come on back here, boys. Don't want to get charged by the pikemen. There we are. What are you? Mercenary hoplites. You're actually a good unit. Better than their, like, levy pikemen and stuff anyway. You know, not quite the royal pikemen, but better than the levy pikemen and all that stuff. Yeah, they should break soon. Come on, boys. Break them. Yeah, that's them broken. Levy pikemen. Get up here, boys. What are they? Illyrian mercenaries. Rubbish. Trash troops, really. Kill those phalanx pikemen if you can. They might fire at us. Come this way, boys. What are you? The Thracians. Let's get there. Yeah, we're, we're a bit slow now. Because uh, we're a bit tired. Very tired, most of these troops. Very good. Come on, boys. Get that way. Militia hoplites. More. Oh, militia ones. They're, they're trash. Do have a, they do have a lot of units kind of left. Um, Phalanx pikemen. We have a, we still have a bit of ammo though, so not too much to worry about, is it? Let's get up here. Those royal pikemen still have quite a few troops left. Let's go. Shoot these boys if you can. They should break as well soon. Okay, they've come back from routing, which is weird. Let's come this way. I'll try to get shooting those royal pikemen if we can. Did lose a few troops. Not a lot, though. Like, how many have we killed of them? Yeah, we killed nearly half. I think we'll be able to clean up the rest with our bodyguards, to be honest. This is our faction air. He's got a lot. He's got a big bodyguard. Those militia half plates should break. From just overwhelming force. The amount of enemy troops. Let's get up here, boys. We nearly run out of ammo. We'll keep these boys here to focus the troops, but we'll bring these uh, general, this general through. If we can try and kill that general, it'd be excellent. Um, 
Right, boys, you've all run out of ammo. Get a bit closer. You could probably break a couple of those militia hoplites just from overwhelming force, right? Uh, take the wolf skirmish mode, but I would prefer you to fire at the general. Uh, okay, General. If you want it, you you can have it. That's all I'm saying. Now get out. Uh, there is still someone shooting. It's that 17 unit of uh, those boys. Surely they will break. I feel like they will break. Uh, okay, let's get out of there. They didn't break. Get that way. No, let's put it on just normal speed. Try not to waste too many troops. I don't want to like... Well, we are trying to rebuild this army. I know we can retrain these boys, so... With the general still alive, it's going to be hard to break him. This way. You go that way. We'll get the big boy around this way. Oh, General's on the left hand side. Don't want him to die there. Well, squeeze them. Oh, get out, get out, get out, get out, get out, get out. Yeah, they're going to break, obviously. Levy Pikeman. Facing the wrong way. Very tasty. Why do they die instantly? They're running into the back of the pikes, not the front. Right, General, get out. You get sandwiched there, bro. Ah! Well, at least he's not died. <laughs> get out! I told you to get out! Pikes are not to charge into. Okay, rusty is probably the word I'd use right now. There, whatever those light lancers are, they're shite. Get out, get out, get out, get out! It's the general's bodyguard. You boys come back. Only 19 of them. I mean, we can destroy this army. I'm not going to retreat, but it's just annoying having to deal with these uh, plumbing. Are you guys that way. Uh, pikes. You boys here. They're still routing. Units. Embarrassing. Get into them. Kill him. Charge these boys. We need to kill that general. He's, uh, he's routing now, so... There we are. Perfect. Killed by peasant horse archers in pyjamas. Fantastic. Okay, get into those boys. Is that left Royal Pikeman really, isn't it? Ah, come on! Um, I don't understand how they still die even though they don't have their pikes up. That's so stupid. They should, you'd think they would have changed that. Alas, no. Thinks they have their pikes up even though they don't. Just come in front of these boys so that they still want to keep the pikes down even though we're charging them in the back. See, look at that! Like, they just instantly died when they charged them. That's Phalanx Pikeman, not Royal Pikeman. You get into those militia hot fights. We can retrain all these boys next, uh, next turn, so that's the main thing that's important right now. We can destroy this army and retrain them. The only person we have left is the Royal Pikeman. Which would have been nice to shoot a bit more because they're going to pose a bit more of a problem. How many have we killed now? We've only got 10% left so they should fully be dead now that that general's died. New General Foreman. Aristoxinus. 
Aristoxenus. Oh, uh, they've broken already. Um, right, get there. You boys, no, 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 no. Get there. You boys get here. Get here. All we need to do is break these guys now and then we are home dry. Fantastic. Come on, boys. Withdrawing. They've not got their pikes down, they're running, so screw them. That should be an absolute shredding. Yep, kill them. Kill them all! Battle! You have already won the battle. Yes! Fantastic! There we are. Those horse archers did the most. 165. Wow. Yep. Strong. Well done, boys. Fantastic. That is what we like to see. That is brilliante. I think it's going to take. Yeah, it's probably just going to load a bit slow. Just been a, bit, a little bit slow today. It's probably from all the third age that all we've been playing. Like, it's probably made the uh, computer a little bit slower. Um, but yeah, enjoying this campaign anyway. It's it's good fun. It's uh, it's pretty good. I just want to kill all those uh, darn Romans, and then uh, I think. We'll try and kill, once we've killed all the Roman factions, that's probably where we're going to end. Because at that point, we'll be so unstoppable. We're pretty much unstoppable right now. So, the only person that could have slight resistance is Romans. Once we, if we, you know, go full map completion, killing all the barbarian hordes of troops just won't be fun. It'll just be exactly the same, repetitive over and over again. So... I don't know. We'll guess we'll see when once we once we get to killing the end of the Romans. It'll still be quite a few more episodes before we've killed the Romans. Like we've not even got past Greece. We're not even in Italy yet, and it looks like the Scipii are doing quite well. They've taken Northern Africa, Victory! Carthage, and all that oh, stuff. So uh, retrain these boys. Get some more troops. Keep training. Fantastic. Enemy army routes. Yes. Superb. Alexander in reverse. So we've got moved up there. You don't have anyone on, do you? No. I just want to check all my ships just in case because. Like you. Like, ah, you have two archers on. Um, send you here. And we'll get you to pick up the next the next batch of, of troops we can get war elephants here now so we actually don't need to train them here once they're done these guys are done we'll move them across and then uh, we'll start training the war elephants here in Sidon can we yeah see we can recruit like the Persian cavalry in Sidon maybe not Damascus Jerusalem no not quite but what about Tarsus uh, not quite but it's okay Right, Rhodes, we're leaving Rhodes for the time being. Uh, I meant to press on the ships. Nope. Right, Athens. Yep, not quite. Corinth, let's go and take you. Yep, war dogs, some princapes, and a general. Are they bringing another army through? But I don't see how that's going to make a difference to them. Hmm. I'm sure they'll have quite a few troops left. Um, but we'll have to look at the faction ranking at the end of this episode. Because we looked at it at the end of the last episode, but we hadn't quite... I don't think we ended the turn from when we destroyed a few of their armies. So, um, if we look at the military ranking, I'm sure we'll see a great huge dip. Um, which is great. Yeah. Um, yeah, we got the. Uh, I'm 
sure we'll see a huge dip with the Brutii. Uh, obviously the Julii and Scipii. The Scipii oh, are fighting Namidia. I'm sure they're still fighting Carthage. I'm sure Carthage still exists, but they probably don't really have anyone, any enemies right this now. So a grim day. A grim day. Okay. I think it's going to be a glorious day, to be honest. Um, horse archers. Horse archers. General. Oh, no, not cataphracts. General. Go for you. Go for you. Doesn't look like there anyway. Oh, no, they're there. Brinker phase. You know what? We're going to shoot you in the face. Brinker phase getting shot. Everybody likes to see it. Da -da -da -da. I'm sure you do. I'm sure I'm right about that. Doesn't really hit them. <laughs> Your soldiers have brought there we them go. Go here, to the gates. Better. Your siege towers are at the enemy walls. Now your men must open a way into the city. Come on! How little is that killing them? Poor guys are getting burnt to pieces. Now order them on and uh, help the enemy. Yep. Right, Hillman. Get up there and fight those Prinkapes. Alright, General. Uh, I it was it was Prinkapes and oh what war dogs yeah. Uh, war dogs. Um, get this is the most experienced army we kind of have. Interesting. Where are the hillmen going? Hillmen? Come on, hillmen. No, wrong way. Just get here. Ah, we need to take the gates. That was horrifying. I don't really want to lose any of these units. Um, and the, the, the walls are shooting us to pieces. Hillman. No. Brink Bays are coming, uh, going. That's great. Get through here, man. Please. Get rid of those those towers shooting. Uh, rusty is is not the word right now. <laughs> well, it is exactly the word. That's the problem. Stop firing out the sprues. Now we'll send the hillman around the other way. Right, we'll get general here if we can. That one's still firing. Get here. Get through there. Hillman, come here. You can. I want you guys to stay there. What are they? Oh, they're firing at the brink of base. Just, just, just engage them. How are we get? Who are we getting shot by? Go shoot that Roman general. I don't understand. Who are we getting shot by? I can hear us getting shot, but I don't know by who. Um, right, we'll bring you guys through if we can. You're the most experienced, most potent units that we have. Come up to here. Is the general coming through? Yeah. And you three need to come here if you can. Or up here or whatever. General unit. Rules. Let's go, boys. Kill those war dogs. Shoot 
them. Up here. Gonna lose a few troops to those war dogs, but oh well. We'll, we'll. we'll get it done. They're mostly dead. Uh, right. Then we'll get out. You know what? We'll kill them. We'll just go in. No firing. No firing. Let's go. Kill that general. Got nine left. Brilliant. We'll very likely be able to uh, retrain these boys. Once again, sieging with those is <laughs> those horse archers is not ideal, but you know. That's why you've got to take him on the field as much as you can. Victory is ours, Corinth. Exterminate. Yeah, the statue of Zeus gives plus four bonus population loyalty in all settlements. So basically, some of those settlements that were unhappy should now be, yeah, see, like Asakia. 110 now. Um, wonder. Plus 30%. Like that, that. The statue of Zeus gives plus thirty percent, which is crazy. Thirty percent public order everywhere. So we better not have any public order problems from now on. <laughs> Definitely the most OP monument. Um, they don't have a thing here, do they? Also, we can get them, give them games, Roman, Roman-style games. See, they've got this army coming through, but that's going to do nothing. You can't do anything, can you? You're you should win that easily. Um, right, let's take uh, Larissa. Pretty similar again. Should be quite easy. It's just a wooden wall around Larissa, though. Just a wooden wall. That's a lot easier for us. It's when it's the uh, the stone walls and they have a lot of infantry that's the problem. Um, but, yeah, we've just got to fight all these guys in the field as much as possible. And then do this. Swoop in and take, you know, settlements with three that have three troops in it. If, they, if this had... You know, twenty troops. In. We wouldn't be able to take it with the horse archers. Like it's, it's that's their big downfall. Before the sun sinks in the west, it's on my orders. Um. Oh, baby, look at that spot. To go all the way around to get in, but I don't even need to get in. They do have a. Uh, they, they've got a lot of uh, their towers and stuff here so we'll do that these guys have got a bit of experience as well as a as a group send you forward uh, their units are there okay no problems with that our flights now we've just got two really weak mercenary units as our Units uh, as um, infantry units right now. Can't wait to stand there. I I hope we've got enough range. <laughs> I think we will. Your soldiers have brought their Brilliant. To the gates. Hello. Your there is no advice available. You have no now advice, my friend. That is a very strange looking not from I don't know just the way it's drawn it looks like a superhero kind of thing um, you boys come here send like f you guys to like here along with the uh, generals this is going to be hard getting in yeah, I don't know what they're doing the cowardly enemy cannot hide. You have breached the walls. And no one's Begin firing currently, so if they move closer, that's excellent for us. 
Where'd that other fringe players go? They're going this way around? I don't know. That's a long way to go, bro. Yes, fire. I'm sure we'll be firing over the over the things, hopefully. We can just clean the rest of these guys up with our, our troops. Uh, there's a 42, though. We have 47. It's actually not... Like, they should win that on the very hard difficulty. We can all come up there. That'd be excellent. Might send my general up with skirmish mode on to just shoot at them. How are these boys doing? It's not doing a huge dam amount of damage, is it? Not that it really needs to, per se. Uh, are they just abandoning? Oh, well, they're not abandoning the town centre. Uh, you can like come across to here then. Actually, I'll let you guys come here. Generals, come in. How tired are you, General? You're winded, but you're okay. I don't know what they're doing. They seem to be wanting to run away from the town square. <coughs> Get into the back of these boys. Uh, you guys come here to shoot at the uh, enemy general. So this is their faction air, I think. Um. Ah! Oh, I accidentally pressed windowed. Uh, yeah, you boys, we need you to come here. Um, I'll put you back on skirmish mode. Right, no, not on the fringe phase. Fire at the Roman general. I don't care about the fringe phase. Come on! Why are you so slow? Yeah, get out of there. You guys are all on skirmish mode, don't you? Take you off skirmish mode. Yes. Get out, get out, get out, get out. You fools, why are you running this way? God, the pathing in this... I, I thought they were supposed to have made the pathing better, but it's still fucking shit. You idiots. Kill them. Charge them from the other side, will you? What are you doing? Just, just set up, for God's sake. I just don't understand them being so dumb. Yeah, we, we've 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 hit them from both sides and we're ruining them. Yeah, come on, boys. We have got some armor and thingy upgrades as well. They have one uh, weapon upgrade. Shredding them. I'm assuming we're effective against armor as well with our. Uh... No, we're not. We have like maces. They have like maces. I thought I saw some guy with a mace then. There, there, look. He's got a mace. Uh, right. You boys. Come here. And you should be able to shoot that other unit. He's not going to make it back in time, probably. Uh, we're not going to let him make it back in time anyway. Yeah, I don't know what to do. You, you've gone the wrong way, bro. That's why. Why isn't the uh, town square timer going? I was going to say. Um, we'll go and attack him. Come on, boys. Uh, come on. Problem is, uh, half the unit's like separated from the other half. There we are, I was going to say. They're really messed up. Like, the, the pathing's gone. Like, what's going on here? We just don't know what's going on with the pathing. There we are. 167 infected. 
eight they inflicted. Wow. That was a bit better, but it was a bit of a mess. But all the siege battles with these boys was a bit of a mess. So, yeah, perfect. Hmm. Yep, exterminate once again. The great Parthian extermination campaign. It's horrendous, isn't it? Walking through the land, exterminating cities. I mean, it's what used to happen back in the day as well, which is even worse to think about, really, when you think about... Oh, an assassin. I thought that was a new unit then. I was like, ooh. But no, just an assassin. Assassins are pointless. Like, they're actually OP, to be fair, but we're not going to cheese the assassin game. Gold. Thank you. So, is it me or is Macedon dead? Because they, they, they look pretty weak right now I think that's everyone we've got to move uh, are we moving any more elephants down here I don't think so ah the other thing we've got to do is fight these boys that should be really easy uh, so I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna end the turn end the episode there guys so thank you very much for watching and um, at the start of the next episode we'll take out those horrendous Numidians who want to fight us uh, and we'll take them out and then we'll go on to the next few Numidian cities. It's going to be a while that we're in the desert but oh excuse me um, it's going to be a while that we're in the desert but it's going to be worth it but yeah thank you very much for watching guys please do like subscribe all that good stuff Thank you for watching and I'll see you again on the next episode.